Hey, it's Tom from Sonox. Welcome to our Introducing Listen Hub series. If you're new here, this is a set of videos that's going to help you get up and running with Listen Hub. We'll cover how to get set up in each door, using the mobile app, and demonstrating how to use Listen Hub when you're making music. In this video, we'll be covering Logic Pro, so let's jump in. Let's start by opening Listen Hub. Once the app is loaded, let's navigate to Listen Hub's menu bar icon, scroll down to output device, and select either your computer speakers or your audio interface. Next, navigate to your computer's audio input and output settings. We can get here by clicking on the Apple icon in the top left, opening system settings, and clicking on the sound tab. Switch to the output tab and select Listen Hub System. Next, let's open Logic. And once our session loads, click Logic Pro in the menu bar, select Settings, and then Audio. In the Output Device drop down menu, select Listen Hub Door. Make sure to select your audio interface in the Input Device drop down menu if you're planning on recording. At this point, everything is set up and ready to go. Listen Hub's real time audio switching is achieved by routing all our audio sources into it. So let's say we have a reference track that we want to listen to on Spotify. For this demonstration, I'll be using my local files folder to avoid copyright issues. I'll select the playback mode to loop, select my reference track, and nothing comes out of our speakers. But don't panic. Let's navigate back to Listen Hub app and see what's happening. Right now, we've set the Listen Hub app to play door one and two. But if we take a look at the inputs tab, we can see that the LED is off for door one and two, but there's a light appearing in the system tab. Let's see what happens when we click on it. And there's our audio. So remember when we set Logic up as Listen Hub door and the rest of our computer's audio as Listen Hub system? This is where we can switch between two separate streams of audio without them playing at the same time. So if we go back to Logic and hit play, we can now freely switch between our reference track and our session. Let's say you also have a reference track that you want to drop into your session. So how do we switch between those in real time? Simply drag your audio file to a new track and set its output to output three and four. Now we can flick between three different audio sources, two of which are set up in Logic, and the other letting you stream from wherever else on your laptop. If you want to get fancy with it, there's a mobile app that lets you control Listen Hub remotely. Download Listen Hub from the App Store or Google Play Store and connect up your device to the same Wi Fi as your computer. Alternatively, you can plug the device into your computer via a charging cable for a tethered connection. No more tabbing between your door and Listen Hub. Thanks for watching. We're going to cover Listen Hub setup in the most popular doors, so make sure to subscribe to see a bespoke tutorial for your door in the future. Happy referencing.